And we already did almost half damage to the walls, so... I am not concerned at the moment about that. Uh, I guess we're gonna move up here and build a lumber mill? Should come in handy. How far can you make it in one turn? You can go here. So horsemen are made there. We don't, we're not big enough. What do we need? Population seven, that's 25 turns away. Let's try to get our population up there so we can build an encampment here as well. Catapult. Let's hit this city. We're gonna bring your walls down. Jericho style. Break the walls down! Well, you're gonna attack this swordsman over here, though. But everybody else, for the most part, you're gonna get some health back by pillaging. Let's try to bring this wall down as much as we can. Are you guys uh, fortified up here or something? What are you guys doing? You are fortified or something. So let's bring you guys down here. Send him up here. And... Wow, we can pillage and do a ranged attack? I guess our movement's that high. That's still surprising to me, though. Catapult's making it across, which is good. Yeah, I mean, Japan is not putting up much of a struggle here, but we do... We did surprise attack them, so... In some aspects, it's kind of expected, but I still thought they might fight back a little more. They're bringing knights in. The knights are hurting my immortals pretty bad, but... Overall, though, it's not, they're not doing much. Okay, my catapult is nearly dead, but he should be able to finish off the walls. We can kill their catapults that are, that are there. Total wall damage. That's good. Okay, let's try to kill this. Melee attack might be better. I still can't kill it in one go, so let's do two ranged attacks and uh, maybe a melee attack. What's your range going to do? Range will kill it, so let's just do three ranged. We're bringing horsemen down to help. They'll help a bit. Let's see. We can chop this and then build a, a mine in its place. And that'll help get the unit out a little faster. Just a little faster. Okay. I'd like you to heal. I'd like you guys to try to kill this knight. Or at least damage it enough to where he doesn't finish off our... A mortal friend that's down here with him. I don't know. I don't know. We held them off. The walls are down, so the walls are not a problem anymore. 
This is more just a question of what that knight's gonna do. Probably has enough experience to get another level, so it'll probably level up. They're bringing in crossbowmen. He didn't choose to level up, so we are, we'll be able to kill him this turn. Without mathematics, there's no. So, let's see. Can this catapult? He still can't uh, level up. Maybe after this hit. There we go. Promotion after that one. That's good. So let's see. Can we take this? Oh, this immortal's just uh, got his levels, so we'll get that going. Down the night that's causing us a problem. Let's deal with this crossbowman as well. Basically, we just want to keep this city surrounded deal with these threats as they show up. I'm thinking that Japan's going to be a bit of a pushover for us. Although they can really hurt my catapults pretty easily. So we remove the woods, we get another catapult. Now we have multiple catapults, so... I mean, that's pretty solid for us. They don't have any more people to murder us, at least not directly adjacent. Nothing within visibility can hurt us right now, other than the samurai in the city. So. Let's bring our horsemen along to help out. The horsemen will just run around the sides and have them pick off like crossbowmen and stuff that come to try to help. Let's get a water mill and let's get that uh, industrial zone upgrade going as well. It's all going to help out a lot. We could probably not build any more catapults from this other than to replace catapults that go down. Let's see, so we can build a mine here. Let's see, so he can upgrade. Let's move this over here. I'll move you a step closer. I'm going to step this guy over here so he can do his upgrade. Crew weapons, he'll come in. Can he... Oh, you can move in ranged attack because of just the significant amount of movement you have. That's pretty handy. No doubt about it. So this city is going to go down at probably next turn, maybe this turn. I think it's going to be next turn that it goes down. Uh, that'll be at least the way to do it without taking as much damage as we could. Because we'll be able to just catapult it twice and then have one of the immortals attack. Or catapult it once and have an immortal attack. So Japan, although way ahead of us in tech, has not been able to cope with our ball of death here a little death ball is giving them a hard time let's build knights down here i do want to build that other building but knights are going to be extremely effective so it looks like japanese uh the japanese cities Democracy. will fall relatively easily to us which is good we need, let's just get production across the board right now. 
like so. I'm going to build a uh, Paradisa, or whatever it's called. Those are pretty cool. And let's start working towards... Do I want to get Theocracy this game? Can buy land combat units with faith. I do like that. Although, so exploration, I do get the better internal trade routes. So getting a couple more trade routes is nice. I think both both approaches are probably fine for this game. But we're going to start with this. Can I just send this guy in and capture it? Probably, I think so. So let's just do that. Okay, so we've captured this Japanese city. And now we have to deal with knights. Knights into dreams. I was not really a fan of that game. It was always like one of the the big hotness things for the Sega Genesis, which I didn't have the Sega Genesis when I was a kid. I, I was a I was a Nintendo boy, rocking that Super Nintendo and that Nintendo sixty four back in the day. But I played a little Knights at, at a friend's, and I'm like, you know, I'm not all that interested in this. It may have been clouded by the fact that I was also not. Not really a uh, a Sega fan overall. Although I did love the Sonic games, I liked playing Eternal Champions too. Uh, that game was fun, but probably probably doesn't hold up to this day. I don't know if any of you played Eternal Champions, but it was like a a fighting game with some specials and stuff. I think it came out before Mortal Kombat. But it reminded me a lot of playing Mortal Kombat. Okay, let's repair the monument. Let's buy out a Ancient Walls. That's so useful when conquering cities, is I can just go buy walls right afterwards for 80 faith, man. That's awesome. I'm gonna murder your uh, religious unit because they're annoying me. We have your knight partially surrounded. Surrender. He's impressed with the unique culture my people are uh, developing. That's good. It's a culture of war. That is the only culture we desire. Is the one of war. Hey, it's Caesar. What's going on, buddy? You got some nice looking armor. All right, how, how are we looking on the charts, by the way? I want to make sure no one's, like, winning in religion or anything right now. Okay, they're not out of control in religion. Anybody out of control in culture? No, no one's out of control in culture. So this is good. Japan is still number one in research, but we're going we're gonna to bring them down a peg or two with some war. We're already taking their cities. So we're already on our way to bring them down here. Okay. Let's deal with this knight. Got a natural wonder here, which is, uh, what is this one? 
Two uh, impossible natural, two tile of the thing provides gold and science to adjacent tiles. It's great that you built faith here like a jerk. Because, you know, that would have been cool. Whatever. Whatever you guys want to do, even if it's wrong. Okay, let's send this guy in to defeat him. And now we're going to have this horseman go over here to rest. And we're going to start moving our catapults in for the attack. Man, that movement bonus is so good. So good. It really is freaking strong. <laughs> Alright, what can we do here? We can build a market. Our money's in good situation right now. Let's get a monument going. Okay, we took a little damage from the city, but not much. You are another Judas, come to betray the Lord, and he denounces me. Get out of here, Philip. All I'm betraying is everyone. If the Lord is included in everyone, then you're right. Bomb the walls! Okay, let's give you tortoise. The power of the tortoise. And just like that, the walls are gone. You stand no chance. It's actually kind of silly how little chance you stand. Versus the awesome power of the immortals. I'm going to grab astrology because it's one turn and I can actually maybe build some temples and stuff eventually. Okay, I built my encampment. That means I can start building uh, knights if I like. But let's get the university going. Let's keep our science rolling. I don't believe in astrology. I'm a subject to those who in quarrel. Alright, so we have... I still like this setup we have. At some point I might drop this adjacency bonus thing for science, but right now I'm keeping it. We're going to continue our onslaught of Japan. Like we're some sort of giant kaijus rolling across the land. Except we're merely men. But we're men that move fast. And strike from a distance. Let's surround Osaka so that we get, uh, we prevent it from healing up. Surround it! We basically need this immortal to move one space over. I guess we could probably, yeah, we could do this. There we go. Now it's actually surrounded. This town is going to go down fast, and then we can move straight into Kyoto. Dude, they're falling so fast. It's crazy. What do we want, though? We want, uh... We want to get upgraded... Siege units? 
So we're going to go for uh, at least figuring out where some niter is. Just going to help us uh, make those units at some point. We'll be able to make bombards. Uh, let's see. Who do we like here? I think your districts provide plus one great person point for of their type for the theater square districts. Oh, just in general. Okay, let's work on Stockholm. Getting great people faster is great! Oh, we're about to get... We're about to get a great scientist. I could stop building that university. Although I could just have... I can have them build a university and I could have the scientists go drop in the other... Uh, the other town. Because it's going to pump out a free... Free great scientist for me. Which will be handy. Catapults, go! Okay, let's roll in. Bring in our sign, or our uh, catapults again. Is there, a, is it B to do a ranged attack? What's the hotkey for ranged attacks? It's B for Bombard, but I don't know what the hotkey is. It'd be nice to have the hotkey for the uh, Immortals so that you choose the appropriate one. But uh, this Osaka's going down next turn, no doubt about it. Uh, I need to take a break real quick, guys. I gotta go use the restroom. So I'll be back in a couple minutes. Uh, I'll see you guys shortly. Where's my little BRB thing? BRB? How do I... How do I do this? Uh, I don't remember how. So I'm just going to leave it up. Be right back.
Hey guys, I'm back. Apologies for the intermission. But we can continue on with our conquering right now. I did just move in room of, uh, in range of their capital bombarding me, but probably it'll be fine. <coughs> it was putting him at unnecessary risk, though. Let's see. So I'm going to be dropping the great scientist in this town and get a free university. That'll happen shortly. So I'm going to start working on the market. And now, let's see. I might just fling two immortals at this so that I can move my catapults at full speed towards the capital. Because I need to, I don't know if I'll still have my movement bonus, but as long as I have it, I need to be making Create use of it with those with catapults. Heart. Build with the mind. And we've lost it, so. Yeah. That's unfortunate, but it is it's the timing that we got. So I'm going to move in to get ready to start bombarding. We can just use these immortals to finish this off. Should be no problem. You can get in range over here. So Kyoto, I won't be able to surround unlike the other ones, but I st should still be able to bring down the walls pretty quick, hopefully. Okay, let's send, just send you in to take it down. So we can take Osaka. We can take Kyoto next. I really don't think it's gonna be a problem for us to take Kyoto.